Hey, what's happening, boys and girls? Alex here in my home borough of New York in the west end of Toronto, and we're here at Weston Road and Jane Street in the city's very diverse Mount Dennis neighborhood. It's such a beautiful late morning here in the city, today being uh, Thursday, April the 20th, 2023. And I just uh, exited 8119 on Route 89. And there's an Orion 7 OG hybrid on the 35. And what's the temperature right now? I think it's uh, 7 Celsius. And uh, yeah, it's been a while since I paid this neighborhood a visit again, despite this not too far from where I live, but uh, the major difference is that I haven't even filmed a walking video on this part of Western Row between uh, Jane and Eglinton. So this is either going to be a walking video along entirely, like entirely in Western Road, or I'm going to veer off on some side streets because there are a lot of very interesting uh, things here. Now this neighborhood has a huge black uh, population. West Indian, Caribbean as well, and I also got a friend that lives around here, but she's probably at school. But the, but the, but the main reason why I'm out here in this part of town is, uh, I was just in my old hood of Kielsa Eglinton, was I had to pick up something that I had forgotten yesterday. And since I was like, and since I was like right here, it's just like, why not, uh, why not make a little walking video around Mount Dennis, which I've always been fascinated with. This is a famous fish and chips place that doesn't look to be uh, in existence anymore. Look, for lease, and it still has a sign up. On the positive side, there's a lot of uh, hardworking people and businesses that are coming out here. It's amazing. And look, here's Route 171, which uh, predominantly uh, operates in a circuit along Western Road, then Jane Chidui, then through the Mount Dennis Garage, and then to Black Creek Drive and Eglinton. It is one of, I believe, two routes that don't even serve a friggin' subway station. And Route 89, it's a Wilson route, which I do not like. Because the Mount Dennis Garage, it's literally like, it's literally around the corner from here. It's been like this for two years. Why, why, why didn't you switch it from Mount Dennis to Wilson? I mean, I like the route, but uh, not the buses uh, it's being served on. Jeez, it just looks so weird. And the fact that there's no more NG hybrids at Wilson, it just makes it like, like much weird, you know? That over there behind the sound barrier, that's the uh, Metrolinx rail corridor. I thought of veering off here, but uh, we're gonna stay right here. Also, this neighborhood has a, uh, also has a huge middle class population. Actually, I wouldn't say huge, but, but uh, I know this neighborhood does have, I know this neighborhood is a partially low income neighborhood that's that has greatly improved in recent years. And currently we are walking southwest here. Or sorry, no, southeast. And I don't know if I'm going to be using the zoom much on this, despite there's a CN Tower sighting, clearly. But I was having some trouble operating this thing. I was waiting, of course, I got off the 32 at Weston and Eglinton, and I was waiting like a good seven minutes for the 89. And uh, the friggin' thing, it was making so much noise as I was trying to zoom in and out. And something was definitely wrong, and then it just, it was just fucking things up, and, uh, and uh, it wouldn't even focus for so long. But then I finally fixed it, but I don't trust it because probably after this, it's gonna keep doing that shit. So I'm, I am already having my sights set. I'm getting a new digital camera. I wouldn't mind getting a Canon, 
or another Panasonic, Nikon, not so much. But if 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 this if this stupid thing keeps doing that, then it's it's a piece of shit. It's gonna be fuck off. Bye bye. Here's Bartonville Avenue, and there's the Native Child and Family Services of Toronto, and uh, there's a pharmacy here. There's also a library coming up that's uh, that's uh, they've been working on, or is it already built? I know uh, that library is supposed to be have is supposed to produce uh, sustainable energy, something like that. Oh god, another engine diesel on the Western Road! Ugh. Yeah, if I if I lived in this neighborhood and having to rely on the friggin' 89, I'd explode. Remember the remember those pre-McNichol days we would see OG and NG hybrids on the on the streets and the GM New Looks? And even, uh, and even, uh, Proterra's. Good CN Tower shot in the sight, but I don't think I'm gonna zoom in. Because, again, it's gonna make these stupid, loud, annoying, clicking noises. Since my dad is well experienced with cameras, perhaps I'll leave it ask. And also, this, this is, I'm gonna, like, tweak around with it. When I get home, this might have an exam coming up. There's Ray, here's Ray Avenue. If you make a left here, you'll find yourself right at the Mount Dennis garage. And, of course, the Mount Dennis LRT facility. And, yes, this neighborhood will be served by the western end of the Eglinton Line. Mount Dennis Station will be a huge and important transit hub connecting buses, commuter trains, and of course, up express trains to the airport. And I also love the banners they have of commemorate, like, just depicting the icons of this neighborhood. So if I'm not mistaken, maybe you guys can comment down below. Maybe this is the award, this must be the award-winning library. The sustainable library, if I'm not mistaken. of going on the other side but I think the side is a little more interesting we got storefronts constantly and also you got the CN Tower view I'll tell you what if this video doesn't do so well in terms of the quality and the, the performance well maybe I'll still publish it but I'll probably do a retake that's if I can get this freaking thing fixed or get a new camera but you know how expensive it is to buy a new one? Huh. There's a local Domino's when I was growing up in Kielsdale. My dad and I would always go to this Domino's, grab some pizza. Ooh, baby, here's another thumbnail opportunity. Yeah, imagine, as I mentioned before in every walking videos where you got the Sea of Tower in the shot, just Imagine you living right here on the street, or maybe any of the side streets that have good views, and uh... Oh look, there's the uh, street sign here. Yeah, like, imagine you get to see a tower on- whoa! You know there's a crosswalk right, be right behind me, but... Yeah, imagine you got, imagine you got the view like 24-7, it's, uh, it's amazing, you know? So there's the Domino's. York Burger. I would not mind trying a lot of these uh, well-known independent restaurants here. Most of them are West Indian. I love West Indian food, Caribbean food of all sorts. Though we have plenty of them in my area near Little Jamaica. There's the, hey, there's the storage facility. Maybe you guys can, sorry, I was gonna, 
I was just about to try something, but then the zoom wouldn't really work and the uh, camera, of course, went out of focus. So yeah, bad idea. We're not gonna we're not gonna zoom it, but clearly you can't see the uh, the vehicles. These are Bombardier Flexity Freedom vehicles. And here's Eglinton Avenue. And coming up is a recently uh, recently installed mural. Not this one, but you got the old pier with streetcar and the CN right there. But it's one of the best. It's one of the best. So right here on this, right across from the Scotia Bank, is this. I have filmed this many times, if you guys watch my series of random clips, but this is a beauty and I absolutely love it. This was, uh, it's, this was painted on like not too long ago, I'd say like, what, half a year or something? But it's just gorgeous. I love it. There's another one, and there's the Welcome to Mount Dennis sign. And there is a closer look at the commuter rail station. Uh, okay. Supposed to, or probably not. This is a big intersection, but who gives a shit? Why don't we uh, cross over to the other side? Because there is another well known art installation just down the stretch, and then we'll turn around. So now we're on the West side. Oh no, that that's the library. I wonder what that uh, new building is. It does look it does look like a sustainability effort. So uh, I forgot this is the library right here. Maybe they're adding a maybe they're building a new community center. I don't know, but uh, it very it very much looks looks like it. But this is the brand new uh, library right here. CN Tower is still visible, but not really. It's been obstructed by those trees, but it's still there. It's like I never left. And then maybe we'll take some side streets up to Eglinton, and then we'll head east. I hear something rustling. Is that a squirrel? Oh look, Route 71, not a Mount Dennis route, but a Queensway route. I've only been on that route once, filmed a ride on it, and I probably won't again. It's weird seeing you here for the past two years. Oh, this is the Salvation Army, your community church. Okay, I think it's around here. Look, York Avenue is named after the borough we're in right now. Oh no, it's the next block. All right. I've always loved walking like south down Weston because mainly you got the CN Tower view. It just looks very fitting. So this banner depicts the art installation we're coming up to. It's not visible yet, but we will see it. I think on Dennis Avenue coming up. And then at the lights, we'll cross over and take some side streets back to Eglinton. Royal Canadian Legion, branch number 31. I know there's one on Kingston Road in uh, 
Scarborough. Oh, hall rental. That's so we do have a banquet hall in there. I was right because I got invited to a birthday party that'll be happening right here in two days from now. But unfortunately, <laughs> I am very, very busy this weekend. <sighs> Exams. I got one tomorrow. But nevertheless. Oh look, Dennis Supermarket. Now this art installation was installed in 2014. Here it is right here. I wonder how good this looks at night. Okay. Just at the time, it's now 12.04, so now we're heading back to the east side and we'll head back. Sorry, I'm just getting a message. From someone. Actually, you know, I could continue this video and head east of Eglinton to Black Creek, but that's gonna extend the video long, like much longer. And also, I've already filmed Mount Dennis Station lots of times, and I can always come back here, but I'm just. I just want to make it sh like short and sweet, especially that this friggin' camera is having some problems. Hopefully my dad can help me find which which may offer good repairs like for cheap, but I probably doubt it. Anyway, there's the go station. Maybe we'll find a, uh, maybe we'll catch a train or two here. It's so around Bar Avenue. And this street, there's no, uh, street sign for up there, though. What the heck? Yeah, a lot of the homes here, mostly single-family ones, but, oh, wow! There's still some old ones. These homes remind me, reminds me of those you see on Jane Street between Dundas and uh, Bloor. Oh, look at this though. Wow. Love the two circles. Round glass. Oh, I think I do hear a train coming. Oh, f shit. I s swear I just heard the horn of a train. Uh, I found a train here once. Oh, that's a CP train. I'm not a huge fan of freight trains. But there it is, and there's the old Kodak Heights building. I think it was an old warehouse factory thing. Now this is Brownville Avenue. Old sign, ball and hockey playing prohibited. Old city of Yorka sign. I would like to wait. Oh, that was short. I would anyway, I would like to wait for a passenger train to come by, but don't want to be uh, 
dilly dallying here. Union Station, two minutes. Let's look at the uh, Western departures. But uh, guys, I think that's gonna be it for uh, this one. Mm, maybe I won't wait because this camera is just uh, driving me crazy. Well, not actually crazy, but. But I'm ready to get going now, so guys, so that's gonna be it. I don't know if this is the last video with this camera, but also, uh, hopefully I'll get things sorted out with this because I am going away. Okay, well, not really for a night, but for a day trip to Buffalo, New York. Uh, might get a walking video there and Brandon Clubs, probably no public transit. I don't think I had town riding it there, but walking I'll try and of course random clips. I put a poll up. So I think by now, when you see this, that should be up, but uh, anyway, I can't wait for next Wednesday, but hopefully this thing will be uh, working fine. I doubt it though, but if you enjoyed, leave a like, comment, subscribe if you haven't already. As always, stay tuned for more videos and check out my others as well, and uh, have a great week. Peace out, guys. Bye-bye.